I'm Dr. Dave Thompson, volunteer here at the Palm Springs Air Museum and a member of the Board of Directors. Um, I'm particularly happy to be here today uh, because I can have the honor of uh, introducing in a little bit uh, John and Cheryl Benoit, Supervisor John Benoit and his wife Cheryl. Cheryl has a POW bracelet that she acquired in 1970 and she's going to uh, donate it to the museum today. It'll be the second bracelet that has been donated that will be part of our POW MIA uh, display wall in our new hangar. This, by the way, is the first bracelet that we received. I was 20 years old. Yes. <laughs> yeah, was and the name years. on the bracelet was? It's Sar Staff Sergeant David Demick. Um, he came from Venice, California, and uh, when I went to pick up the bracelet, I was picking up multiple ones, and I asked for one from California. So at the time, I was working as a volunteer uh, for USO in Hollywood, and so um, during that time, we all did our best for our people going overseas, the veterans and coming back, of course. And um, so I went down and picked up quite a few bracelets that we all wanted to share amongst us. We took these bracelets and we wore them conscious, conscientiously every day. And it, it was the least we could do. Um, it was something that we could go any place, people would see it on our arm, and it was, you know, it was our badge to give back to the military that we were doing something. Well, thank you for doing that. I know no, you did Okay. Um, Mr. Fred Bell, front and center, please. Thank you so much. And out of the camera here, you can't see, but we have all these docents around us, and many of them were Vietnam vets. And unfortunately, people did not get the recognition. And we kind of glossed over the fact of a lot of these men that didn't come back. And the families remember, but nobody else does. So thank you very much for this.